Hey, hi, and howdy to all my sweet friends out there. Thank you for joining me back here on my channel. If you are new, I am Courtney. I do kitchen-related content, grocery hauls, what's for dinners, meal preps, that sort of thing. So if you like that, make sure you hit that subscribe button, stick around, and then drop me a comment just to say hi so we can get to know each other. All right, y'all, it is my weekly grocery haul. Um, this one was bigger than I thought it would be, but, you know, what do I say? I mean, I just, I always get too much stuff at the store. It's just what I do. Um, anyway, before we get into the groceries, let's talk meal plan. I'm keeping it pretty simple this week. Big Mac wraps, crunch wraps, buffalo meatballs, and chicken pesto pasta. They are all super easy, which is exactly what I need. Um, we have been sick at my house now. Plus, we are back to school. We've got our co-op stuff. We've got our martial arts. So we're super busy, and I just need to get, like, my footing, and then I'll get back to, um, you know, like, more traditional style meals. But for now, I got to keep it simple just so I can kind of get into a routine. Anyway, y'all didn't come to hear me chat, so let's jump right on into that grocery haul. Hey, hey, friends. I just got home from a doing, I want to say, a little grocery shopping, but it kind of looks like a lot of grocery shopping. Um, I ran into H-E-B because they have cat food in stock, and they had a couple things in stock there that they didn't have other places, or they had, like, specials. So I ran in there for a couple of things, ended up getting more than a couple because that's how I roll. Um, and then I ran into Market Street for a couple of things that were on there um sell flyer so at market street i spent 65 dollars and at heb i spent 50 dollars um what you don't see pictured is a big bag of cat food it is i can't see it it's 16 pounds of cat food but i only paid 12 dollars for it because there was a coupon yay so i got that as well but let's go ahead and dive right into all the goodies you see before you all right, right here I've got some thin sliced sandwich bread, 98 cents. Uh, let's see, in here I've got some squash to make a squash casserole this weekend. Um, by the time you see this, I will have already done that, but we are smoking and grilling again this weekend and I wanted some fun sides, so we're gonna do squash casserole. $1.58 for those three squash. I did get this giant box of Reese's Puffs. This is the only cereal my son Camden will eat. It is his favorite, the only one he likes. So I do pick it up pretty often. I paid $6 for this big box, but I got this eight pack of Go-Gurts for free. So you can't beat that deal. Uh, let's see, back over here, I picked up some chips. Uh, I buy those every time I go to HGB. They make them in store and they are phenomenal. I got three of these little like on the go instant mashed potato cups. Jensen really likes these. These are $1.38 each. Uh, oh, you can't see it. This is blue cheese dressing. I love blue cheese dressing. Um, it is my favorite, but I'm the only one that ever eats it. I'll eat it on salad. I eat it on buffalo wings and all kinds of stuff. So I picked some up because we are, or I'm trying to do some buffalo meatballs. Let's see, this was $3.98, but then I had a dollar off coupon. So it was actually $2.98. Uh, this salsa right here, salsa pasilla. I've never tried this before, but like I love salsa. I love chips and salsa. I snack on chips and salsa. I serve it as a side when we go to the restaurant and eat all the chips and salsa. It's like one of my favorite things. So when I saw this, I had never tried it before and I wanted to. So I just went ahead and picked it up. It was $2.98. I got some penne pasta for um, a pasta dish this week. That was $1.12. I got some mac and cheese cups right here because I forgot to get them at Sam's Club. Uh, these are $3.72. I got some salami and pepperoni. These were all on markdown for $1.98 each. So I went ahead and got two salami and one pepperoni. I got this salad. It's a double dill salad. Uh, it was half off. You can see the yellow sticker right there. So I paid $2.14 for that. I got some hot dog buns. I have hot dogs in the fridge and freezer. Jensen likes some. So I picked up some buns. Those were $1.94. Um, this oat milk is on special for 89 cents because they are clearancing it out. So I went ahead and grabbed this. I've grabbed some every time I've gone between the oat, the almond, and the coconut milk. The coconut milk is now completely gone. The oat milk is almost gone. Um, this is probably the only one that I'll get. But next week, if I want, I could probably get another almond milk. So we'll see. Then I have this mint right here, uh, $2.68. That's for making um, sweet mint tea because that's what we like but that is everything I got at H-E-B and like I said I did go to Market Street uh, let's see I got all of the stuff most of it was on sale but there were a couple of like impulse things so like this morning I was watching um, the Watts on YouTube while I was putting on my makeup and stuff 
and she made these brownies that look so decadent and delicious. They were like a French silk brownie. And I just thought to myself, you know, at 7.30 in the morning, gosh, I need those in my life. So I didn't in fact have to buy brownie mix. Uh, she recommends the Gary Deli, which I don't think I've ever tried this one, but it's $3.99, but you know, you only live once and brownies are fantastic. So we're just gonna go for it. But I did go ahead and get that um, so that I can make these French silk brownies. Um, I got some Tide. This was on special this week. It is $9.97. There's a coupon. Um, so it was a pretty good deal. Went ahead and picked that up. I tend to like to get my uh, my laundry detergent and stuff at Market Street because they put it on sale pretty often and I can get the stuff I really like because um, while I will use the cheap stuff and be fine with it, like there's no complaints, I do have a preference. Persil and Tide are definitely my absolute favorite just because I feel like they actually do a better job on the clothes. So if I can get them on special at Market Street, well, that's where I'm going. Uh, let's see. Oh, Clementine's got two bags. They were on sale. They're $3.97 and then there's a dollar off coupon. So they were $2.97 each for me. That's a pretty good deal. There's a limit of two. I got two. Uh, some bananas for $1.25. The avocados were also on sale this week. There was a limit of three, but I only got two. They were $3.97 with a dollar off coupon. So I paid $2.97 for each of those. Um, I did get this Swiss cheese right here for some roast beef and Swiss sandwiches, $2.50. Cream cheese, that's for the French silk brownies, and these are $1.79. These mashed potatoes are for dinner tonight. Um, I'm stopping in to film this and put away my groceries, and then it's field trip day with our homeschool co-ops. We are going back out, and then it's martial arts tonight. So my time is very limited, so I yeah. put these mashed potatoes. I got a rotisserie chicken at Sam's Club and um, I'll whip up some gravy so we can have KFC bowls. That's going to be dinner because it's quick and easy and I can throw it together once we get home later. I did get this whipped topping for $1.59 each. Also for the French silk brownies, uh, I got these tomato. well, I got these tomatoes at Sam's Club. Hang on, we'll get there in just a minute. Uh, I got this chloroseptic throat spray for $3.99 because one of my kids, I think it's allergies, could be sick. We're going to kind of just see how things go. I've been keeping an eye on him um, today, and he, he's playing and doing stuff. His throat just seems a little irritated, so we're going to see how things go. I also picked these up for him just in case, because, you know, I didn't want to take any chances. Get some extra vitamins in them while I can. These are $2.49. It's canned. He's a super picky eater, really picture, picky about, like, texture and stuff of food, um, and he likes everything very bland. So I know I can get these in him because he'll eat anything that's in, like, applesauce form. Okay. Uh, the last few things I got were I got two rotisserie chickens, but they are hidden in my oven because I have dogs and they're bratty. I got these tomatoes for $4.98. I got this brown sugar for $6.98. My impulse buy were these macadamia nuts for $7.98. And then I got some tortillas for two of our meals this week. Those are $4.91. That is what, oh, and I also got uh, roast beef, like deli roast beef. It's $12.97 and it's already in the fridge because it had been in my ice chest for a while and I just wanted to get it put away. That's what I got at Sam's Club. Not much at all. That's why I didn't really put it out because it just wasn't worthy of a haul. But that is in fact what I got. But this is the majority of my shopping. I do have a couple of things coming from Walmart because there were some things that were like super low price there or I was just having trouble finding. So I'm going to get a delivery from them like tomorrow or the next day and I'll add that to the end of this. So I will see you guys when Walmart gets delivered. All right, friends, Walmart just dropped off my delivery. Not a ton of stuff, but uh, there were a few things that I needed here. They were better priced or out of stock elsewhere. So I ordered them from Walmart. I had them delivered. Um, and here's my haul. So let's go ahead and dive right in. This is the last of the groceries for this week. Thank goodness, my gosh, that's enough. More than enough. <laughs> All right, so we got some um, Great Value brand Pop-Tarts. I got the chocolate and the cinnamon. Again, quick breakfast on the go because we have co-op and stuff going on during the week. And I know they're packed full of sugar, but it's just easy. And right now I need to find my footing and our routine. This is new. We have not done a co-op before. And I'm rearranging our schedule, like, to make sure we're fitting in our actual schoolwork and things like that. So I'm kind of just um, in a place where I'm figuring things out. So Pop-Tarts help me do that right now. They are $1.92 a box. Um, I actually ordered Mucinex Fast Max, I don't know, all-in-one, something or other liquid medication because... Um, the cold that I was talking about Cam having the other day is, uh, I have it now too. I started getting it last night. So he got worse yesterday. We didn't actually end up going to our field trip or to our martial arts class because he got so much worse so fast. And last night at about like 1130 or 12, when I was trying to lay down and go to sleep, 
my throat was starting to bother me and I had been blowing my nose like nonstop. So I knew at that moment that um, all hope was lost and it was too late for me. So I added this to my order that I had already placed, um, actually the Mucinex, but they were out, I guess, because I subbed this and it's better than nothing, but I think my husband said he would stop um, later on his way home for lunch and grab me the Mucinex that I like. So hopefully that'll help. Uh, back here I got some battery. Oh, sorry, wait, that was 1098, just so you know, 1098. I got some batteries because remote controls always need batteries, uh, $3.68. These Ritz cheese crackers, again, taking them on the go when we got a co-op and stuff, they're very convenient right now just to kind of give us a snack because um, we go quite a few hours, so it's just nice to have something on hand with our water bottles and stuff. So $3.52. Uh, this is my favorite gum and I'm almost out, so I ordered some more, $3.78. Pine nuts. I don't know that I've ever um, purchased these before. I've had them before, but I don't know that I've ever bought them. They are very expensive six dollars and 92 cents ouch but there was this pasta dish that i'm making and it had pine nuts in it and i happen to know for a fact that i do really like pine nuts so i was like you know what we're gonna treat ourselves and do it so i went ahead and bought them and i got some milk for the milk drinkers in the house two dollars and 92 cents i got some wax melts two dollars and 22 cents each fall festival and apple cedar wood the apple cedar wood i've smelled before and it's amazing but the fall festival, I've never smelled. It just said fall, and I'm like, yeah, why not? Because I love all the smells of fall. So I went ahead and got that as well. I got some uh, Tampinko. It's not like healthy orange juice, but I really like it. Um, so I went ahead and got this just because I knew it would just make me feel a little better. $2.78. I got some eggs. We're going to do deviled eggs this weekend. My husband's going to smoke some ribs and stuff. You will see that in my meal prep as, long, as well as... Um, prepping the rims, a squash casserole, and I think I'm doing a pasta salad too. And I'm trying to fit in a dessert. Um, if I just keep feeling worse throughout the day, the dessert may not happen. We'll see. But anyway, that'll be in the meal prep video for the week that comes out on Thursday. The rest of the recipes will be in my what's for dinner. All right, so eggs, $1.54. I got some butter because I couldn't remember exactly how much I had on hand. And I've been using a lot lately because I've been making chocolate chip cookies. So I went ahead and ordered some more, $3.68. I've got some lash glue in there because I do wear um, fake eyelashes. I just like the way they look. And it took me a long time to master the art of putting them on. And now that I have, I'm never gonna stop. So I bought some more glue, $3.97. Bought these meatballs to make buffalo meatballs. Um, I saw it on Jessica O'Donohue's channel and I love all things buffalo sauce. So I was like, you know what? I am all over that. So we're gonna give it a shot. I don't know if I'm gonna serve it on potatoes or rice or pasta or what, but we're gonna definitely give it a shot. And then of course I got the chocolate soak. You guys see me buy this every week. This is, or these are $2.98 each. So a total of $5.96. Oh, and the meatballs. The meatballs were $6.86. So that is what I got. I also ordered um, another electric toothbrush for my son Cam, because if you watch my haul, Jensen got some, um, or he got one two weeks ago, I think. And then that one's been sold out for a while. So I ordered a different one finally, and it was $10. It'll be here in like a week or so. And I also ordered hmm, something else. Oh, some face lotion. They were out of my face lotion. I like the e.l.f. brand. So I ordered that. It was a total of $10 for that and $10 for the toothbrush, um, including like taxes and my delivery fee. I spent $96.96. Can't beat that. That's an awesome number to look at. <laughs> How cool is that? Anyway, that is it for this week's grocery haul. I hope you guys are all having a fantastic week so far. I know when you see this, it is Tuesday. It's Friday for me. But it's Tuesday when you guys see this, so I hope your week ahead of you is amazing and wonderful and awesome. And I hope to see you guys back here on Thursday for my meal prep and then again on Saturday for my what's for dinner. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you soon. Bye.